Guys, it's Ordient Gaming, and this is my first premiere video, and I just want to see how it would work. And I thought I would show you Nintendo's second worst console, the Wii U. I personally love the Wii U. It was my favorite console until the Switch came out. I liked it even more than my DS, probably because the library was pretty good, for me at least. And it was pretty fun to just, like, hang out with my friends and just, like, play all these older games on it. So I like that. So I got the black standard 32 gigabyte model of the Wii U. It was actually a Christmas gift and this is probably my favorite like TV console. My Switch is more handheld since that's how I like to play these days. So we got Yoshi's Bully World, which personally for me, I recommend you go like 100% complete this game. It's a very good game. Like, I recommend if you haven't played this game, like, go buy it. You can probably get it for like 20 bucks. It's it's really good. Um, Disney Infinity. I don't really have much to say about this. I'm not a real big fan of this. It was just a gift from my sister. And oh wait, I think I know what that's in there. Sorry about that. So Infinity, I don't really enjoy it that much. It, it's a good game, just like. Not my type. Legend of Zelda Wind Waker HD. This is a very fun game. It can get a tiny bit boring when you're sailing on the open seas. But when you're actually like playing the game inside of like different dungeon stuff. This is a very fun game. The disc art is pretty cool too. Um, Super Mario Bros. U. This is... Well, I mean, it's Super Mario Bros. game. It's not the best. They're all, they're all kind of the same, so if you've played one before, it's basically the same. But it has Luigi U, because this came out in the year of Luigi with the DLC. And that disc art, it, it's probably my favorite disc art, since I love Mario, but I, I like this game. It's the reason why I really wanted it. But all these games are a lot better. So then we had Twilight Princess. This is a very, very good game. It's a hard to set up though, cause it takes like three hours to get like into the first dungeon. Well, if you count Ferrum, well, kinda, basically. Like, but I mean, it is a very good game once you get into it. It is a really long one though. So sit down with a few friends and just like start playing that. I have two copies of Splatoon because I love this game. When I got it, I got like when it launched because it looked really nice and I saw the different stuff for it. But now it's like, thing is, there's way too many hackers online, but it is a very good game if you find it. Thing is, one of them broke. I think my brother accidentally broke it. So that's why I bought second one, but the cases are still really cool. I also have the amiibo. I might do a video on that label or later of all my amiibo. But these are my Splatoon games. I like um Splatoon 2 is probably my, one of my favorite games on Switch. Then we have Mario Kart 8. This is a very good Mario Kart game compared to the other ones. It very it has pretty good graphics. I liked how it introduced the zero gravity mechanic. It's a pretty cool game. I recommend you pick it up, but if you have a Switch, just get to Lux. Because it's basically this game and more. It doesn't have the battle system, like your traditional way. So you might not enjoy that, actually. Then Hyrule Warriors. This is like my first Dynasty Slash game. Hack and Slash, because I haven't tried one before this. But I mean, I like Lechazelle, and I got this as a gift. And it is a really fun game. It kind of gets repetitive. But it is fun to just like go through all the different worlds as different characters. And yeah. So I'd say if you had to get like two games out of this, I would say Yoshi's Bully World and probably Splatoon. But Splatoon might, if, you, if you're not into shooters, probably a Wind Waker. But yeah, that's my Wii U collection. I hope you guys enjoyed my first premiere video. I'll be in the comments, hopefully typing if any of you are actually watching this. I'll probably set this live after. So I hope you guys enjoyed, and 
I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye.